what is option pricing remember every option for its holder is a right without any obligation therefore if this option is in the money it is an asset for the option holder we understand it very well this right that the option holder has will entitle him to some financial gains in future obviously so when an option is in the money uh, assuming that it continues to be in the money in the future as well uh, this is going to result in financial gain uh, in future and that is on the date of expiry uh, in favor of the option holder and therefore uh, for the option holder an option which is in the money is an asset is an asset so really speaking uh, now what is the value of this asset the value of this asset is present value of these likely gains to the option holder is the value of a call or a put option as the case may be so uh, we understand it very clearly so when there is an option which is in the money whether it's it is a put option or it is call option so uh, the amount uh, by which it is in the money and uh, the time to expiration that you have so if you discount the amount of in the money on a call option or on put option by the risk free interest rate for the time to expiration what you will get you will get the present value of this call option or this put option and that is how you find worth of an option call option or put option for the purpose of accounting in your books as per the indian accounting standards likewise please remember as the excuse me sir yeah uh, sir aapne start kahan se kiya uh, okay so we started uh, okay joined late uh, pooja yes sir okay so we started uh, okay i'll just quickly uh, give you an idea remember yes, sir, every you. every option uh, for is holder is a right without any obligation right isn't it we understand it very well jo bhi option hai to wo jo uska holder hai uske liye wo right hai lekin uske liye wo obligation nahi hai yes sir and therefore if this option is in the money and we understand what is the meaning of in the money uh, that mean that means this option is an asset for the option holder to abhi jo humne thodi der pehle discuss kiya ki when an option is in the money सो अगर एक कॉल ऑप्शन है इफ यू हैव अ कॉल ऑप्शन एंड द इन केस ऑफ द कॉल ऑप्शन द स्पॉट प्राइस इज इज ग्रेटर देन द एक्सरसाइज प्राइस दैट मींस दिस कॉल ऑप्शन इज इन द मनी लाइकवाइज इफ देर इज अ पुट ऑप्शन एंड इन केस ऑफ पुट ऑप्शन इफ द स्पॉट प्राइस इज लोअर then the exercise price that means this option is also in the money right so when an option is in the money that means this option is going to give a value to the holder of the option on the date of expiry isn't it uh, assuming that the amount of uh, the in the money continues okay it it can go up and down so long as it is in the money uh this option will have some worth for the holder of the option now how to find out the value of this option so the simple method of finding out the value of an option call option or put option which is in the money is to uh discount the in the money amount uh by the interest free ra rate of interest risk free rate of interest risk free rate of interest for the time to expiration so let's say for example 
uh, if an option has three months to expire okay and if the rate of in if the risk free rate of interest is seven percent and if the in the money amount uh, as it stands today let's say is hundred and seven okay one zero seven so if you want to find out uh, as to what is the present value of one zero seven so how will you find out one zero seven divided by 1.07 into 3 months because that is the time to expiration and divided by 12. So when you solve this uh, uh, calculation, uh, the amount that you will get is going to be the present value of this uh, option, the call option or a put option which is in the money. This is what we were discussing Pooja uh, before uh, uh, maybe you joined us. Okay. So this is in case of uh, the option holder. So remember in case of the option holder, uh, it is an asset and correspondingly for the option writer, it is a liability because what an option uh, holder has to receive, uh, the option writer has to pay. So what is an asset to the option uh, holder? Uh, it is a liability for the option writer irrespective of whether it is a call option or it is a put option. So that means what that means for every option writer, it is an obligation obligation without any corresponding right. So it is an obligation. The person who is writing an option, he only has an obligation. He does not have any right. So therefore, if such an option is in the money for the holder of the option, then this option is a liability for the option holder. And how will you find out the value of this liability in the same way as we have discussed just now. So please remember as per INDES that is Indian Accounting Standards, all assets and liabilities including financial assets and liabilities are to be disclosed in the books at fair value. And how do you find out the fair value? You find out the fair value uh, by one of the method and that is as we have just discussed now on the date of the balance sheet. So uh, as per the Indian accounting standards, please remember and I'm sure all of you must be aware in any case already. So Indian accounting standards case uh, uh, the companies to which index has become mandatory and the companies whose net worth is more than 250 crores. Remember for all those companies index is mandatory uh, uh, mandatory and not only it is mandatory for the companies uh, whose net worth is more than 250 crore even the holding company and the subsidiary company of such a company to them also by default index become mandatory. So all such companies now have to disclose the value of their assets and liabilities in terms of fair value and this is how you find out the fair value. Okay, so pricing of option is not only required for the purpose of uh, disclosure in the financial uh, uh, accounts, uh, but also for the purpose of decision making. So, if you have option purchase, karna hai, aapko nahi karna hai, it will depend on as to what is the price of that option and how does that price meets with your return expectation. And that is friends, your option pricing. Now, there are five fundamental factors that affect pricing of an option. 